Hey guys and girls, I'm going to be doing a couple of unboxings today. One is the Scooby-Doo Where Are You? The Complete Series. And the other one is one of my favorites. It's the Get Smart Complete Series. Let me just move that a little closer down. There we go. So if you guys have never watched Scooby-Doo, I highly recommend watching it. In fact, you could probably skip the rest of the video and go and watch it. No, please don't. I, you know, I actually do like having people around. It's kind of lonely with this magical waterfall in the background. Uh, as some of you may know, I'm doing a move in a couple of days, so I'm going to be putting out a few videos uh, just because I won't be able to film them for a few weeks. Anyway, uh, so getting back to the, um, the video, the... Um, Lead box sets. I'm going to take out Get Smart for the moment and I'm going to show you the Scooby Doo. Now, the Scooby Doo box looks like the Mystery Machine. I actually rather like that. So, you can see the characters on it, and the bumper, oddly enough, is actually a separate piece. So, you got Scooby, Daphne, Velma, Shaggy, and Fred all sitting usually where they like to sit in the cartoons. There's a side view and on the back there's a whole bunch of stickers of Scooby-Doo. So Mr. Machine, the SD for Scooby-Doo, his head, a bone, uh, and all sorts of other little hints. Anyway, I'm going to open it up so it just slides out like a drawer. And there it is, the Complete Series DVD Collection. Now, unfortunately, underneath here is empty. So it's my belief that you can actually put any of the other series inside here and it will just fill it out. At least that's what I think somebody was planning. So it's Scooby-Doo, Where Are You? The Complete Series DVD Collection. Special unlimited, uh, sorry, special limited edition, 41 episodes on 8 DVDs, over 15, uh, 15 hours of Scooby-Doo fun. So, when we open it up, the cases come on a flip carousel sort of thing, on the jewel case. And the discs are actually nicely put in. So then no chance of it falling out and scraping around. On the inside, you see the black tracks. It's so that you can slide the inside in and out easier. This is actually a very well thought out box. I'm, I've very rarely seen anything like it. Now, this one is kind of a fun box. This is called the Get Smart Complete Series. Um, this is Maxwell Smart, uh, Agent 88, or sorry, 86. Um, it was a Mel, Book, Mel Brooks production, I believe. And um, the box has this photo on it, a stylized photo, and really not much else. Just says Get Smart. But what's kind of cool with this box is when we open it, if any of you are familiar with the intro, um, then you might know what's coming up. So you get to uh, open up the first door, the second door, then it's going to be a little hard to see here. It says telephone, and then so you open that up. So you have to open up all these doors in order to get to the actual. DVD collection. So I'm going to pull one of these out at random. I don't think there's a need to pull them all out. I happen to grab season four. So season four comes in a slip case, plastic slip case. You open it up and it has some information on 
the show in here. So special thanks, producers, and that sort of information. And that just will slide right back in. Otherwise, it just unfolds. And it's one of this style where you sort of have to pull out one DVD in order to get to the next. Sometimes that's a bit of a pain. Especially when you're trying to put it back and you've watched the uh, disc 2 and then you get on disc 3 and then you have to come back, pull the other disc out and put it back in. But I think that's a little bit of a minor annoyance. Otherwise it's a very nice packaging. And I believe the woman is Agent 99. Uh, they originally were going to call her Agent 69, and I guess they figured that that wouldn't play well. Yeah. So, comes in the nice case. That's all there is to it. So, that is, if you've ever watched the to show, and I don't, I don't mean the movie, um, the new movie, newer movie, it's an excellent series to watch. I highly recommend either watching it or going out and buying your own copy. Uh, anyway, guys, until next time, I'll see you later.